Hello, greetings everyone, I'm your host MK Wings, and uh, I'm back, so yeah, <laughs> yeah I'm back guys, I'm sorry, I've been busy as usual, and uh, that's, that's pretty much about it, I mean I've kind of just been taking recordings, like, on my schedule now, like I've been doing it much slower than I usually do, because I've been doing, I used to do like the videos like when they first came out kind of thing, and I still need to do that, it's just I've been so busy guys, you have no idea. Like, uh, for example, I got my hair cut yesterday, which went really well actually, it went really well. <laughs> I would recommend the salon, but it's like, it's too close to my house, uh, I'm not leaking my location, okay? <laughs> but, um, I got my hair cut, it looks amazing, um, it looks really good though. Honestly, you know what, I wanted to say this, and I find this is like the perfect opportunity, but I don't even know why I wear this mask, guys. I'm gonna be honest with you. <laughs> like, I feel like it's just for, um, the character, like, that I'm going for. Like, um, what? I don't know. It it's just like, I'm not afraid to show my face, you know? Like, that's not a problem. <laughs> but I feel like I like being this, like, online persona of, like, ghost face kind of thing. I don't know, I, I like it. Maybe I'll do a uh, face reveal once we reach 100,000 subscribers, guys. We're getting so close, and I can't thank you guys enough. I'm super excited. But let me know what you guys think in the comment section down below if I'll continue the ghost face legacy, or if I should actually start using my real face in these videos. I don't know. I feel like another issue with why I don't show my face is that I'm, I'm really just camera shy. Like, my whole life, I've always been like super nervous around cameras like being recorded and especially online you know with people being weird and stuff so i don't know it, it acts as like a protection and it also you know lets me be funny because you know the mask is like it lets me do stupid stuff <laughs> so well i'll see you guys let me know in the comment section what you think i should do and i could still use my mask but then show my face at the same time i, I don't know well we'll see you guys um, we won't actually retire the ghost face mask, so I, I could do so much more, you know, I could actually breathe and my audio would sound better, <laughs> so, you know, we'll see, what do you guys think, let me know in the comment section about that. Other than that, I've been super busy, but I haven't forgotten about you guys, I still love doing YouTube, it's so much fun, and today we're gonna be reacting to the brand new episode of Home of Us, yeah, let's give a round of applause for that, shall we? <laughs> I totally forgot there was gonna be another episode in June, so... Why don't we head on over to Viv's page? Okay, so we got Helloboss Apology to her Season 2 episode done, which was about a week ago. Um, I was going to do it last weekend, but I was busy, so we're just going to do it this weekend, because, yeah, yippee! <laughs> so, yeah, I'm super excited for this though, guys, and I hope you are too. So, without further ado, let's get right into this. <laughs> Alright, there it is, guys. We're going to click on it. Here we go. It's about 30 minutes, so I got 9.7 million views. The amount of views these episodes get just shows, like, how much the community, like, is, like, thirsting over the next episode release. <laughs> also, I, I know I'm not wearing my usual outfit, it's just, like, it's so hot. Like, I, I can't, I can't go without a t-shirt right now, guys, there's no way. <laughs> Let me just make sure. Right, that's better. Uh, so I did want to say one more thing, actually. Um... Because last episode, we at the end, you know, let's do a little bit of a recap. So last episode, um, you know, Stolas and Blitzo got into that huge... Did I just call him Blitzo? Shame on me. Anyway, uh, they got into that whole fight at the end of the episode, right? With the Osmodian Crystal and Blitzo at Stolas, and Stolas kicked him out of the mansion. And I was saying, like, how is next episode going to continue knowing that they're on bad terms? I forgot that the next episode was the Apology Tour, so... Things are about to get juicy, guys. This is probably gonna be a sad episode. And I'm really nervous, so, um, here we go, guys. Uh, one, two, three, let's go! Uh, the, we're in the following cartoon contains scrap of all the strong and with sexual themes, flashing lights. I also hear the clock getting faster in the background, too. Okay, love the visuals, as usual. <gasps> it's so endless. Hello, 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 Stolas. You, uh, you haven't been answering my text, and I sent you a bunch of funny shit, so what gives? I was hoping my lack of ha-has in response to the photos you sent would be an indicator I didn't want to talk right now. Oh, Aww. come on, Stolas. We just had a rough night. Besides, you always want to hear from me. <sighs> Blitz. 
What is it you want? I want to feel like I'm earning my way to Earth. Okay, so get your tight feathered ass out of that lawn chair and into the bedroom so I can fuck it. <laughs> wow. Poetry. I'm sure such a statement would have had me swooning by now. Uh, Aww, this is yeah, sad, sure, guys. Okay, that was a shitty way for me to say it, but you usually like it when I talk all dirty and fucky and shit. <laughs> Come on, we don't do words, we do sex. As shocking as this might seem, Blitz, I don't think I'm in the mood to do sex with you. In fact, I don't think I'm even in the mood to do words with you. So how about you respect that? Oh, come on, Stolas, you can't mean that. Mm. You always love seeing this. Seeing you right now is hard. I don't want to feel worse than I already do. It's bad enough I got an invite to this anti-blitzo party. <laughs> what the hell? invite for being your freshest ex. Anti-blitzo party? Who the fuck's behind this? Oh, it's entirely immature. I'd never indulge this nonsense. It's silly. Real silly. Real fucking classy. Kind of them to invite me, though. It might be rude not to make an appearance. Brossica! <laughs> of course that fucking bitch. I will say, it's That's rather so concerning funny. you have an entire party devoted to hating you, though, Blitz. Oh, please, everyone hates me for shitty reasons. In the end, everyone's just bitter they couldn't tie this ass down. I'm too much imp to simp. You really <laughs> think that's the reason? Yes, sir, they couldn't handle that I moved on. Oh. So you're used to being the one who crushes others' feelings, hmm? If by crushes others' feelings you mean <laughs> to get serious, then bingo! I'm doing everyone a favor because relationships are boring. Oh yes, damn! This is the asshole right now, Dad. Waiting for you to realize how good an angry fuck would be right now. Get out! Right now! What? I'm tired Dude, of guys, this. this I'm so uncomfortable sad. with how you're speaking to me now. Oh, come on, Stolas. You can't tell me this isn't a fantasy of yours. You want me to show your rich, princy ass what a real fucking is. Stop it. Ha! I'm right, aren't I? You get off to getting plowed by people you look down on. I don't look down on you. How many times do I... When have I ever... You speak just like that vile striker friend of yours, the one who tried to kill me and you couldn't be bothered to come help me. Remember him? Hey, look, I do not sound like... I, and I didn't know he was capable. I, I stopped him the first time, didn't I? The first time? Yeah, the... Oh. Uh -oh. Oops. I, uh, no, who said that? I... You knew someone was trying to assassinate me? I, I stopped him. Guys. And I really didn't think you could actually get hurt. You, you're immortal and shit. You're a fucking prince. If me and my team could yeah. kick that guy's ass that easily, then I'm sure you'd have no problem. I suppose you are right. Silly me. It's not an imp's place to protect a Goetia, is it? And there it is. Took you long enough. That's all you were waiting for, wasn't it? For me to play into this idea you have of me that I'm this prince who thinks he's so much better than you. Well, I don't. Why would I allow everyone to see how much I like you? How I've tried so fucking hard to spend time with you, to support you? You don't owe me those things, but you can't just ignore all that. You know, Stolas, I spent the entirety of this morning listening to love ballads. And that was still the gayest thing I've heard all day! Do you feel any kind of remorse for what you do? Have you ever even apologized once in your life? Oh, you think I can't apologize? For what? You want me to be like, oh, sorry this entire time. I assumed the worst because I was convinced a prince could never love someone like me and I let my self-hatred stop me from apologizing to anyone I could never care about. Well, yes, that. This well, is the sad guy. fuck you! Bro, no, fuck Blitz, man. I actually, he's actually getting on my nerves this episode. Sorry, more people. Wait, hold on, hold on. What did you say? Well, yes. Seriously? What did you say about people? Well, I don't know about to. Fuck you! I can sorry the fuck out of people. Just you watch. I sorried Fizz so hard he cried. And I can sorry oh. more people. Everyone but you. Because I don't owe you dick. Everyone but you. Damn, guys. Oh, sorry. I'm so sorry. Damn, guys, this is this fight. What the hell? Blitz is a fucking asshole right now. Blitz, you better goddamn redeem yourself, bro. I'm about to do this on YouTube, man. Possibly be. Yes. What the hell? It's you. Hey, Martha. Look, I know we killed you in the past, but I just wanted to say no hard feelings. It's Martha. 
What the heck? Yeah, that's fucking right. What the hell? I, I don't even know what I just saw. Is she dating? The girl, the girl, what? Uh, no comment. That's crazy. What? Oh, so he's apologizing to everyone by giving them flowers? And he's going back to all the characters we've previously seen, like the side characters? Cool. Oh my gosh. So is he just giving gift baskets to everyone? So stupid. Sorry, not sorry, Funky. <laughs> now on to the exes who are all in one place. <gasps> Yay! So he's using his hand to spread a pistol now. That's cool. Hey, buddy. You know where six 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 South Maple Avenue might be? Down that way, demon dude. Sick costume, bro. Hey, happy Halloween. Oh, looks like you missed some makeup there. Hey, <laughs> is that most of Brandon Rogers? So stupid. It reminds me of his actual videos. Oh gosh, dang it. <laughs> gosh, guys, this episode is crazy. I'm gonna have to talk about this a lot at the end. Holy. So these are all the people who he blitzed with. That's wild. A lot of people. Or maybe half of them are this legit there for the party, I don't know. The one day a year the spirits can rise amongst the living and it's spent celebrating mutual pettiness. The uh, what? Oh, nothing. Oh, is there there? Are they there on Halloween? Oh man, I wish I was That makes more sense now. I should have known that from the moment I saw the human costumes. Oh, is the song about to break out? Hey, it's Rosica! Hello? Cool. What? Okay. I don't, that made me well, fine. I felt it rude not to stop by. I don't get invited out much, but I really shouldn't stay long. Oh, well, this I'm is sad, guys. You can make it, honey. I like well, this is beats the last Earth party I attended on Hallow's Eve. Oh, it is Halloween. The demon prince stole us. Oh, I was told there would be cake. Oh my god! <laughs> what the hell? That's crazy. Speaking of cake, you want to slice it? Oh! I like to start at the neck. Or the dick. <laughs> I'm trying to like rock out of the wall. Oh my god! <laughs> Ten without slicing any of it. Well, live it up, baby. You are with friends here. Fuck Blitzo in the fucking ass! You know, honestly, I I'm feeling the vibe of this right now because Blitz, this is gonna be a fucking asshole. It's crazy how many people hate Blitz right now, though. That's kind of wild. That's also kind of sad on his part. What the hell? Have I fucked this many people? Christ on a stick. I should start keeping count. Oh my gosh. Sorry for the comment I made at your sister's wedding, though she did deserve it, she's a whore. Sorry for fucking your mom, though I thought it was your dad. What the Hey! He did it. That outfit makes more sense, you though. You fucking suck. Yeah, yeah I like how they're bringing back all the characters we see, and that's cool. Lucky he puts <laughs> His like outfit from the trailer makes more sense now. It, it makes yeah, I get it. Oh my god! Is that the plushie? Oh my goodness, what the hell? That's so stupid. It's time to hear from the special new guest of honor of the night, Stolas. Ah. Uh. I kind of like Verasica, guys. I'm not gonna lie. I like the new outfit. Tell us all about your experience with Blitzo, the cock-sucking motherfucker. Come on, baby, speak from your heart. We all here know how you feel. Um. Ooh. <laughs> um. Is it gonna sing? Yes. This is cool, guys! Jake! No 
¿Sabes si estás? I love the music, guys. The theme in the background, the guitar, I really like that. It really fits Star Wars, too. <laughs> Guys, this is so sad at the same time. Oh. Thank you for your time. Oh, Stolas and Oh, what is happening? <laughs> this is so sad, guys. I like Stolas' outfit, though. Blitz! What are you doing here? You're lucky everyone is drunk or you would be murdered right now. Ah, no, it's good. I'm in disguise. Wow. I've never seen you throw it back like this. Came just to judge me, is that it? No, uh, I just... This was the final yeah. stop on the apology tour I've been on today. <sighs> Oh yes, I recall. Everyone but me is getting your cheap apologies tonight. Hmm? Well, you certainly have your work cut out for you. Look, how I acted this morning, it was fucked, okay? This morning? Ugh, why did you show up there? Why did you show up here? You already asked that, but look, I, I just really need to, to talk to you, to, to explain. Oh? I've always been real shit at sorries, okay? There for pussies, and no one fucking deserves them anyway, but I <laughs> felt like maybe you actually needed one. Oh, lucky me! Oh, shit. Okay, what I mean is, I said sorry a lot today, and honestly, didn't really mean any of it, because the only one I wanted to say it to was you, Stolls. I just... This whole thing we had going, I, I mean, you're a fucking prince. How could you ever actually care for an imp? Me. How could anybody? Blitz, there is a crowd full of people here who cared so much, they throw an entire fucking party about hating you every year. Do you know how much you have to care to do something as stupid as that? Stolas, you are better off without me, okay? You deserve so much. I don't even know why you would want to be with me. You want to know what I want? I want to know what it's like to not be alone. Aww. I want to be someone's someone. I want to feel wanted, but like 
in a romantic way, like I'm standing out in the rain at a train station and someone is shouting, Harriet, don't get on that train. It's going to London and I cannot be without you. <laughs> oh, Stolas, that's Man. a rom-com. Oh, fuck you. The point is, I just want someone to care. If this I is stay so sad, go, guys. I'm genuinely, me. like, really sad to because see of me. To hold me. Look at me and think, well, you're the only one I want. I desire to hold you and talk to you. Never let you feel so. You! Why are you here? I don't want you here. Oh. Go home, please. Let me not feel so sad. <laughs> oh, guys. This is so sad. I feel like Star is speaking on behalf of a lot of people here, too. That's sad. Oh. Hello. Great song earlier. You have great pipes. Thank you. Yeah, 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 he sings fantastic. We're talking here. Well, I just wanted to see if maybe, I don't know, you'd want to dance. You want to dance with me? Yeah. <laughs> Damn, guys. This is about to feel the pain. There's a shitty apology. That's cool. That's her ass right there, dude. You got talk to her, too? He is! I like her haircut. That's basically how my hair looks like just without the back ponytail. Hey, her. That's cool. So, an apology tour, huh? You got a lot of balls coming here, Blitzo. Yeah, I know. Everyone here hates me. Yep. That's the point, dumbass. So what, mm. you're waiting for your sorry? Oh, fuck you, you little prick. Well, I'm sorry for always telling it like it is, sister. Well, I'm just being honest. I'm sorry for dumping you. Sorry for not falling head over heels for you or that guy or fucking Dennis or, or anyone at this stupid fucking party. Oh, you are so fucking shitty. Literally. You hear yourself. Everyone's shitty. Literally. Hello, we live in hell. Why am I all of a sudden the bad guy just for sucking at relationships? Are you expecting sympathy? Oh, poor Blitz. Finally we having to own that his actions affect other people's fifis. Bitch, please. How do you think I felt when the fun guy I was dating decided to just bail on me because I made the shitty mistake of saying I love... It was the most embarrassing feeling to be vulnerable for once and you really just know how to send a message in the shittiest fucking way. Oh, the worst part guys. is you still make me feel like a bad person for being angry at you now. Damn. But hosting this party for everyone else you've dicked over, at least I can help others cope with the shit you did. What? No snarky comeback? No. You're right. I actually am, you know, sorry. I, I don't want to be this way. Oh, Not forever. guys. I actually really like the last Penna. Looks like Stolas is having a good time. Yeah, well, he needs it. <laughs> hey, yo! Oh, a really good time. Oh, that bird stealing cock back! Hold it, Blitz. You know, if you want to change, it just starts with saying, good for him. Hope he gets laid. <laughs> Here, have some cake, fuckwad. God, yeah, cake is good. That's crazy. I sort of like Roscoe a lot more, though. I feel like she's more of a relatable character now instead of just a slut, but. Damn, guys. Another Veracica I like her son too. But now he's just like looking at all the people he's done wrong kind of thing. Oh guys.
Aww. That's crazy. How is this even gonna end? I like the first song of that. I don't know why, I just really like that. <laughs> Damn, so he's just gonna go home now? Oh my gosh! Not with the cliffhangers! I have no words. Why do these episodes always leave me speechless, guys? Oh my goodness! Wow! I can't even- I can't even believe that, guys. Love the music, though. I really hope that's, like, a single, and then puts that on our channel somewhere. I really love that, guys. Alright, so, we're gonna let this play through and then we're gonna talk about it. So I wanted to spy for a minute. Oh yeah. Oh, we just turned the volume down. Okay, guys, so, what an episode. Holy shit. So, I don't even know where to start. So this was Blitz's apology tour, right? So he, um, uh... You know, first he goes to Stolas, and he apologizes, right? And in, like, the shittiest way possible. That was the worst apology and literally the worst conversation and sad conversation I've seen between Blitz and Stolas. Like, that was just sad at the beginning. And then, so then, Verasco holds this party, you know, where all the people Blitz is, like, hurt and made upset. To like the fuck you Blitzo party on Halloween, which is crazy. So there's gonna be technically two Halloween episodes, which is kind of cool. So and I thought it was really funny when Stolas was like, "Yeah, I went to a Halloween party last month or like last year, and it was it was terrible. And they're like sacrificing someone. It was so stupid. That was funny. <laughs> He's like, hey, "Is that cake?" <laughs> it's so funny. But um. Anyway, so, there's a lot of funny stuff in this, too, but honestly, guys, this episode was really sad, and I feel really bad for Stolas, and like I said, I feel like Stolas spoke on behalf of a lot of people, I guess, for the people who are single out there, because, you know, I used to feel like that, you know, wanting someone to be ro romantic, you know, have a partner who loves me as much as I love them, kind of thing, which I have met that person. I love you, Isaac, if you're watching this video. Um, I have a sweet and loving, amazing boyfriend, guys, and I love him with all my heart. But, you know, I did, I, I relate to that a lot. So that's why Stolas is my favorite character, one of them. So, it's just, that was really sad to hear, I guess. And I like how the show also has a lot of, you know, it, it's not just, like, a funny adult animated cartoon. It's, it's got a lot of deep stuff, guys, you know. Um, you know, about relationships and uh, you know, family issues, stuff like that, you know, there's a lot of deeper stuff when it comes to this show, so I really enjoyed this, though, and there's a lot of other stuff that happened, so Blitz is still trying to apologize to Stolas, but he's just, like, he's just not good at it, and he's failing, and honestly, I don't really feel bad for Blitz, like, I do a little bit, because I understand, like, how his character is, but at the same time, he needs to do better, and hopefully after this episode, he changes his ways, and learns, but also, um, he was, when he was apologizing to all the other characters, like, Martha, she was, she, like, hooked up with the lady who wanted her dead, because, like, she was, like, in the background, she's like, yeah, yeah, I'm a thing, like, I was like, what the hell? <laughs> so weird, I don't even want to ask about that, and then, you know, we saw other characters, like, the guy in front of Ozzy's, and, you know, a bunch of other stuff, which is really cool. And we also got to see Verasica and Vortex. Vortex is there too, but he was kind of like, you know, just there for the duet kind of thing. <laughs> but uh, I really like Verasica's character now. Like, I think she's she's really cool. And we kind of know her backstory with Blitz now, which honestly, she was in the right this whole time. We had no idea. But like, when they first introduced her character, she was just like this like slutty, like bad bitch kind of thing, you know, like, she wasn't really relatable, and they, you know, kind of made her off into a villain in a way, 
But, you know, now that we get the full story and, you know, she's more of a relatable character, you know, I really like Veronica, you know? I feel that, so... <laughs> uh, I think she's really cool. And I really love the songs, too, with Stolas. That was really deep. I liked Stolas' is like emo rock song about heartbreak. I thought that was really funny. <laughs> so, but it was a good song, and it had a lot of deep stuff, imagery and stuff, like hidden messages, too. And then I liked Frosca's song at the end, too. That was good as well. And there, this whole episode was great, guys. 10 out of 10. But it's just, like, the, even the ending is a broken heart. Like, and Stella Scott was someone else, too. It's just like, oh, my goodness. Like, I don't even know what's happening anymore, guys. <laughs> I don't know how this is going to go on in the future, but we'll see. I really hope Stella and Blitz get back together in the right way this time, you know? I feel like... That'll be good. So I keep having to tuck this under my mask because it's like, I don't want to wear it down. <laughs> anyway, but this was a great episode, guys. And let me know your thoughts and theories down in the comment section um, about what you guys think because this is crazy. This is such a sad episode, though. So I hope everything slowly gets better over the next season or series of episodes we'll see what happens <laughs> anyways thank you guys so much for watching this video i hope you enjoyed as much as i did and i hope you all have an absolutely fantastic rest of your day and i will see you guys all in the next video bye Strong, what if I read this so wrong?